Hey there guys, this is Michael Techwin. So we're going to do a uh, overview of the Xbox 360 control, the PC version. And uh, I have this uh, from Christmas and I've been playing it for, oh, I would say for a couple of days uh, with um, Steam. And it's uh, real nice actually. So. Uh, let's take a look at the uh, Xbox 360 controller. So this is a plastic tray that you would get in a box. Uh, you get the uh, CD with that too for your uh, camera. And you get uh, the instruction manual which pretty much uh, it, it's a common book. So we'll take out the, the plastic tray there. Okay, so. So, close up look at the Xbox 360 control. Uh, you got your normal uh, layout joystick, your D-pad, uh, your uh, Y, B, A, X button, uh, your start and back, and this one I'm not quite sure, but for me, on the Gmail, it's, um, if you're on PC, if you, uh, if you uh, if you have the Xbox uh, 360 control uh, application, if you push that, this will uh, bring up the application. So let's we'll take a look at the back. Uh, you got your two shoulder button, uh, then the two upper button on top of these uh, shoulder. And this version is a uh, corded one. And at the end of the plug, uh, th this Xbox 360 controller do come with a uh, USB adapter if you can play it on a uh, PC. So. So, uh, now we can take a look at uh, how, um, before we take a look how, uh, you plug into PC, or before I show the adapter real quick, uh, I'm gonna talk about, um, Steam, excellent, excellent, uh, uh, support for these Xbox 360 controller. They have, uh, when I first plugged in, when I would play my uh, Steam game, it uh, it work, work, it work perfect. Um, it may ask you, do you want to uh, play with this device if you uh, if you uh, if you have Steam. Uh, it will ask you that, so okay. Uh, get the little adapter real quick. Okay, guys. So I got the uh, adapter. Uh, this adapter will come if you bought the PC version of the Xbox 360 controller. You would get this adapter. So end of the wall, end of the cord is this, which you won't if you won't plug in the PC, but this adapter is uh to uh USB to uh this uh connector and if we uh connect it uh 
she would see you. Hello. Okay, so we there was a little dot on the dap door. So that what is uh, this is uh, this is a type door for you a uh, Camille if you want to play it on a Camille. So you did the dab. Luigi for this adapter when I'm done playing with this Xbox uh control excuse the bumping. So I so I said uh Luigi when I'm done with the Xbox three sixty controller, I leave the the adapter piece in in the camera and I did Unplug the Xbox 360 uh, uh, connector, uh, detach from the adapter piece. So that is the adapter. So uh, so now we can uh, take a look. Our uh, Steam can support the. Xbox, uh, Sui uh, 60 controller. Okay, guys, so, um, what I'm gonna do is, uh, launch, uh, a Steam game, uh, and we're gonna, I'm gonna, uh, show you how, uh, Steam do have a excellent, uh, a excellent, uh, uh Steam controller support. So, okay, what I'm gonna show you that, and to let you know, I have a sucky free game to off of Steam, so it's not the best, so it's not the best game I uh, personally explain, but hey, whatever. So, uh, what we're gonna do now is uh, launch the game. So, I just hit play, and you might not see it on. Uh, my uh, screen I'm um, playing at, I have a, uh, I have a door, uh, two screen setup on my uh, laptop, so what you see on the camera point at is my secondary uh, screen. There it is. So I'm gonna escape all these stuff. Now, sure, uh, halfway through this, there should be a window saying, uh, saying something about the Xbox 360 control. So if I had a uh, start. Uh, and you can see the device is missing. Uh, that's what I like about uh, Steam games. Uh, this game does have a uh, excellent, excellent support. Uh, as you can see, uh, right front of you, it's it's real nice actually. So what I'm gonna do is uh, plug in, plug in. I did have an unplugged to show you guys that the Steam does have a, a real excellent uh, support. Uh, real nice, actually. You don't have to uh, monkey winch around with something. So, and I can even. I can even move my little cursor uh, to uh, select too, so that is uh, real nice. And when I just plug in, it there was a little device connected. 
too, so... There we go. So it's uh, it's a uh, real nice game. Real nice game. Did I say real nice? But uh, real nice theme support game. Uh, control real nice, real nice. I uh, do do like it too. A okay. Lot. So uh. I got done uh, showing you the uh, our Steam have a real excellent uh, Xbox 360 control uh, support. Real excellent, uh, real excellent. So you can see right here I have it uh, plugged into my uh, my computer. So I have a plug in. Uh, this uh this glowy light uh tell you how many player that you're playing on the game. So another thing before I forget to let you know is that little uh that little plugin. Let's see if we can get a close up. So that little plugin is a accessory pl uh. Accessory port for uh, your for like a headset or any accessory that you want to get with your Xbox uh, 360 controller. Uh, you can see the light. I wonder what happens if I push that. Okay, well, it doesn't look like that, but uh, I feel like I said before. In the beginning video, uh, if you uh, if you're on PC, if you use uh, your Xbox 360 control on PC, if you have the Xbox 360 control accessory program uh, installed on your Camille, you would get that uh, uh, a little uh, a little application uh, pop up. So you would get that. If you're on a PC, so uh, let's talk about a bit. So, oops, excuse that. So I said, um, I think I cut a little bit too much of myself when I would recording to the screen. Uh, now I could show you uh, if you're playing this whale walk. But sadly, uh, that free game that I got, uh, it's acting up on me, um, when you start playing, it go black, uh, on me, so, not quite sure how long that prob that problem would be fixed, but, um, but if you're playing, uh, some games, now I know everybody it's not a uh uh I know not everybody who have a PC is big at this. I know everybody not um and I know everybody who's gonna play the force shooter game or the racing game. I know not every person would grab this, but uh depending on the game you have this is real nice to have around just in case uh, you want to uh, play a game. And the Steam does have a real nice support. I said before, uh, real nice uh, support for that for sure. So I'm real loving that. So it does work out uh real nice um now this is the 360 controller this is not the xbox one but this is my force um my force impression of the xbox 360 controller and i never owned the xbox 360 controller before 
So this is uh, my first time uh, playing game with this Xbox 360 controller. Um, I'm not much of a console guy. Um, not much. I, I generally play uh, games on my uh, on my Camille Luigi. And lately, I've been getting into uh, uh, Steam, uh, the racing game on Steam. But in the future, uh, I will definitely use this a lot in the racing game. Uh, this is real nice, actually. Uh, so, uh, this uh, this is my my first impression, and. I don't have much experience uh, with the Xbox uh, 3, uh, not much of using the Xbox 360 controller, not much of experience, but I kind of know the stuff that you can do with a Xbox 360 uh, console, so... I never own an Xbox 360. Uh, okay, say again, I never own one. So, this is uh, real nice. Um, the nice thing uh, would, would be nice is um, I am starting out with this Xbox, uh, this one, Force, uh, because uh, I don't want to get something that doesn't work. So, so, and I'm starting with this, uh, and in the future, I really like to take the Xbox One, uh, uh, the Xbox One controller and plug into a PC. If they sell a uh, PC version of a Xbox One for uh, Xbox. Okay, what I said before, what I said before, uh, before I, uh, got lost is, uh, if, uh, the, if they sell an Xbox One control, uh, in the future, if they sell a, a PC version of the Xbox One, I would definitely, uh, would like to play with that a bit to, um, the Xbox One controller is a little bit nicer than, uh, than, the, uh, than, than this, uh, because, uh, some people are having bad luck with the, uh, the D-pad, and some has a button on this, too, so, uh, that is my thought for this, uh, um, Another thing to do is if you don't have Steam, if you have the the big title game, uh, uh, depending on the game, some game I know will support these uh, will support a uh, a uh, a uh, control like this. I know some of the game will so, and Steam. They have a huge uh, support. Um, they do have a uh, a thing called uh, Steam Big Picture, and that will work uh, nicely with this uh, with a controller. So uh, that real nice, uh, and. When I first got when I first plug into uh, my laptop. Okay, okay, guys. Uh, so, um, so my cam uh, SD card got full. So right now I am doing a uh, voiceover. So I'm I'm gonna finish this my sentence uh, before my camera been rude. So, let, uh, let's get back to the normal s sentence that I left off. So, I like to said before, 
when I uh, plugged my uh, Xbox 360 control into my Camille uh, through Steam, it worked fine. It's uh, it it will give you a box option if you want to play with that device. So, uh, <clears throat> so that would be it, and I'm going to end the video, so before I end the video, I will talk to you about something, so uh, check out the link below the video, and uh, feel free to look at the Amazon wishlist. And feel free to support my channel if if you like my video. So that is it. And I'm going to end now.